Welcome to IBC 2023. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries. Exploring groundbreaking innovation across 13 halls right here in Amsterdam. Ashley within broadcast, joining me is Judy of Kilo View. Hello. Hi, Ashley. Hi, great seeing you. So can you tell me, how does Kilo View fit in right now in the media and broadcasting industry? Yeah, of course. Uh, you know, actually, KiloView is the IP-based video transmission solution provider. So, uh, what we are doing is all around IP, and uh, of course, you can see right now IP is becoming more and more popular everywhere. So, for KiloView, we provide a kind of whole ecosystem, not only to bring the baseband video into IP or bring the IP back to baseband, but also we have a system that can be able to manage all the video sources uh, to do those. Kind Kind of recording transmission or uh, those kind of recording or whatever. So that means we are now becoming more and more important. We are playing a very important role for this kind of industry and of course not only for uh, you know, bring the video into IP that can really fit into the for the cloud production or whatever. While at the same time, we will be able to uh, bring our own ecosystem. So that means with KiloView, you will be able to manage everything. So that's really that makes a lot of sense for customers. They will have more options, not only you know with the existing solutions, but also they will probably will have more. Uh, cost-effective solutions or more flexible solutions with kind of ecosystem all from the same vendor. Very good. And so what trends as far as technology are you noticing right now in the media and broadcasting market? Uh, you know, of course, as we are in the IP industry, we always pay attention to the IP technologies. Right now, I have to say, um, in this industry, more and more different IP technologies are coming. Uh, previously, of course, we know KiloView is always focusing on NDI, and of course, NDI is getting more and more popular. While at the same time, we can see different IP technologies, um, of course, coming in this industry, so uh, I believe well, you know, one thing we, we can always be sure that IP would be the future. Well, of course, IP is the basic, uh, the, the fundamental part for like the cloud production, remote production and whatever. So that's, that's also the reason why we're always keeping ourselves in the IP industry. And so what are you currently highlighting and showcasing here at IBC? Uh, uh, there are two parts actually. Uh, uh, one part is of course we're showing our own uh, NDI ecosystem as we always mentioned. So this time we are just uh, trying to show all our products working in the working status. So previously we announced quite a lot of products and this time we're really putting the products in working status. So uh, if customers come into our booth they will really see the products are working, and of course, uh, all those that like our LinkedIn series, the Cube series, the recording, uh, the Cube X1, and also our latest encoders, decoders like the E3, the D350, and also uh, our you know all those kind of uh, products. That's that's previously all the pro previously announced products are working here. Uh, another part is, as previously we mentioned, we noticed SRT and the other IP technology is becoming more and more popular. So even like the YouTube can now support SRT. So currently uh, we are bringing SRT into our products. So um, to more products, I mean, um, like our N50 and the N60, initially we can only support uh, NDI, but this time we're also adding SRT, RTMP, RTSP, and all the other protocols into the products. So that means with KiloView products, it will be more flexible to fit into the IP industry. So not only for NDI, then you can use the same products for your live streaming, for your remote transmission, and everything. So that's, that's always, you know, um, KiloView will be able to offer more flexibility to our customers and even like our uh, the Media Gateway products, we are going to add uh, the SRT, the full NDI and everything in their products. So with that product, you can easily bridge between different protocols. So that's another big step for the IP industry. Very good. And who would you say you're targeting with your current products and practices? 
Uh, so as as we mentioned, we are doing the IP stuff. So it's always, of course, for broadcast, for the media production. That's that's always our main markets, that the target markets. While at the same time, we can see more and more customers in the pro AV industry, in the industry, uh, the education for medical, for all those kind of corporates, and a lot of different companies are also using a lot of the IP technologies. So that's also our target markets. And what can we expect from KiloView in the future? Uh, that's a good question. <laughs> so actually, uh, we are now taking more and more time for the IP part. So previously, we focused quite a lot in NDI, but uh, in the future, probably NDI is also uh, one of the most important parts where at the same time we probably will check the new technologies, the new IP technologies. Uh, we probably will think about like the Dendy AV, we will think about uh, all those SMPT 2110, that's always very popular. You can see at the IBC, so everywhere we can see different technologies. So uh, from this part, we will probably check uh, about all those new technologies. Well, at the same time, we will try to uh, get our current solution to be more uh, precise for different uh, vertical markets. So for example, for edu education markets, for the medical market, for the corporate markets, uh, based on our existing products, we probably will be uh, adjust a little bit of the whole workflow to make our products uh, more, you know, uh, fitable to all those kind of different industries to help customers uh, with a better solution. Well, everyone be sure to check out their website for more information. Thank you so much for speaking with us today.